Hello friends, uh, I'm Parwis and uh, this is our fifth video in PyQt5 GUI programming. Uh, in the last video we have uh, shown how you can find uh, days in a month or find days in a year. Uh, in this, and this code is from the previous video. Uh, if you haven't watched the previous video, uh, I recommend you to watch the previous video. And uh, this uh, video is our last video in QDT and time because after this uh, we want to start our main uh, QTA5, Pi QTA5 GUI programming. Uh, in this video we are going to show how you can add uh, days in a date or how you can add uh, or how you can subtract days from the date. Also you can add month, years and seconds to a date. Okay. Now uh, I close, uh, I make a new uh, Python file. <coughs> I make a new uh, Python file and call it this. Uh, call it my this. Okay. Uh, now, in here, <coughs> first of all, you should import uh, from pyqt5.qt core uh, import. Uh, QDIT time and also QT. Uh, now make a date time variable uh, QDIT time dot current date time. Uh, now uh, I want to print this. Uh, print uh, today today date and time is uh, make a placeholder mm, plus date time dot to string and q dot iso date <coughs> now if i run this you can see today date and time is uh, to the, um, I should remove this sorry uh, and here we don't need any placeholder now if I run this you can see that this is our date and time uh, okay <coughs> now uh, I want to add uh, 12 uh, days to my test date uh, for this you can say print uh, adding 12 days to the to the date okay make a placeholder now dot format uh, take your date time variable uh, dot add days 12 uh, convert it to string and add your uh, date format q dot iso date okay now if i run this <coughs> you can see that uh, it added 12 days and it became from 2017 now it is uh, 2018 okay uh, now I want to add, I want to subtract uh, 25 days from my test date. You can write print uh, subtracting 25 days dot format date time dot sub. Uh, we have oh uh, dot add days. And give it minus 25 okay because we are subtracting 25 days uh, convert it to the string and give you uh, give your date format dot ISO date okay now if I run this you can see that uh, it will sub subtract 25 days uh, subtracting 25 days it became uh, 2017 11 and 29 okay now <coughs> uh, 
we are adding seconds, uh, 50 seconds uh, to our time. Print, adding 50 seconds, give it a placeholder, dot format, uh, date time, dot add seconds, and give it 50. Convert it to string, and give your format, I sort it. Now, if run this, uh, we can see that uh, added 50 seconds to our uh, time. Now we are going to add 3 months, 3 months in our date. Print, uh, adding uh, 3 months, make a placeholder, uh, dot format, date time dot add months mm, we can give it three uh, and uh, convert this to string give your format I sort it now if I run this you can see that adding three months uh, added uh, three months and it became two thousand uh, 18. Now we want to add years. We want to add 12 years in our date. Print uh, adding 12 years. Dot format. Take your variable date time. Dot add year. Add years. Uh, 12. Dot to string and give your format ISO dead. If I run this you can see that adding 12 years it became 2029. Okay guys um, this was uh, our fifth video and I highly recommend that watch from the first video. Uh, if you have any question please uh, let me know and also please please subscribe the channel also like the videos